Hey guys, welcome back to Brunette Confessions. Today's video is going to be a little bit of a shopping haul. I'm going to be sharing with you guys some of the things that I bought for my trip to Vegas that is coming up now. I'm most probably going to post this video after the trip because I want to show you guys how I wore each item, how I dressed it up, dressed it down, the accessories, all that good stuff. So today's video, I'm just going to go individually between each store and the purchases that I got in each one and how everything i'm show you guys how it fits what i like what i didn't like how much i wasted in total i did waste less than 200 dollars so that's good um and yeah we're gonna have some fashion nova stuff some Shein stuff and one thing from pretty little thing so let's get to it <laughs> So we're gonna start with Shein. One of the things that I bought was this cute top. Let's see if you guys can see it. I know in America you can probably see like the back. This was, this is honestly straight up, this was not a top meant for my trip to Vegas. It was just something cute, it was like 10 bucks I believe. And I was like, mm, I'm gonna take it because I know I am going to use it for Sunday fun day. <laughs> so I actually did wear it this weekend. And it's super cute, it's super summery. Um, yes, lots of cleavage, I know, but I love it. It is a size, I believe this is a small, fits really good. And the fabric is not so bad, actually. It's like very thin, so it's good for the heat, for that Miami heat. I approve. So this top, not for Vegas either. I thought it was super cute. Now, problem is that they did not have a small, so I was like, mm, I'll get a medium. Probably fits. I was wrong, it is extremely big on me, so my grandma is going to have to tailor it and get it a little bit more tight here so it can fit good, but it's super cute and I mean, it's cheap. I love Chi and that's my go-to store, guys. Super cute. All these tops are like seven, ten dollars it's... I couldn't help myself. If I was shopping there, I just, I just had to get something extra, not just for Vegas, and I did. So this set, I actually did buy it for Vegas. I thought it was super cute and super summery to like walk around and explore. I don't remember how much it cost, but I will look for it and link it down below for you guys. And here's how this is the whole thing. I'm like in a different setup today. I'm back in my room, back at home, not in my apartment. So I'm trying to, you know, make it this work, but I feel so tight in here and you see the hot mess in the back. but. You know, it is what it is, and I'm trying to make it work, and I think we're good. So this is how it looks, and you know, I just realized as I was putting it on, this is an extra small. I don't know what made me think that my booty can fit in an extra small. I don't know if it was a mistake, or I actually did click an extra small, because probably I read in the comments that it probably ran big or something, so I was like, let me take an extra small. Well, I did, I had, I did, I totally forgot about that. Now I realize, and I mean... It is a little bit short here in this area. I feel like I definitely have to wear this with shorts and just, you know, pray that a breeze doesn't like, whoo, pass by. But it's super cute. I actually really like how it fits. It doesn't fit that bad. Yeah. With some sneakers or sandals. Love it. All right, so this top is also from Shein. It's a little clear. That's why, you know, I'm hiding the goodies with my hair. But if it's really cute, yes, definitely wear it with pasties. You can't wear it by yourself. And the skirt is not part of this haul. The skirt, I had it from Forever 21. So my friends and I are doing like little theme nights. So we have a neon night. And then I bought that sh this shirt with that purpose in mind. And I was actually going to wear it with some like white nice pants. But I'm actually digging it with the leather skirt and like some nice like edgy big chunky heels because the chunky ones are actually very comfy and I definitely want to be comfy so I think that's like the fit I have in mind but I'm not really sure what it ends up wearing but I think it'll be that but yeah mm, looks really good I'm digging it so my friends and I are also having a neon like swimsuit day for one of the pool parties so this one's from Shein um, this is not from part of this haul. I just had this. I just thought, you know, it was a little bit too much to show. So I had to hide it a little bit. And this is a size medium. It is a little tight on the top. I feel like it could have been a little bit more fitted. But I'll make it work. It's fine. 
Um, it's ten. It was ten dollars. If you haven't bought a bathing suit in Shein, you are missing out. Everything is like ugh, they're just so cheap, and swimsuits are not very cheap. They're pretty pricey out there, but Shein, it's the go-to. It's the go-to. Um, I'm gonna show you how it fits in the front. The bikini is very cheeky. It's very cute. I think I'm gonna be wearing this with like neon pink socks and like sneakers, white sneakers. Mm. Love it. And I think this is actually, I think this is actually my last item from Shein. Um, we have another day, theme day, that is going to be animal print. So this is my fit. I'm not aware with this wrap. Actually, I haven't mind wearing it with some like sheer pants because it's like a night swim thing, like a, a pool party at night type of thing. So yeah, I, uh, this is a size medium. I think it fits good. Um, let me see if I can show you a little bit the front. I don't know if you can see it very good. It's very cheeky fit in the back. So in total, in Shein, all these, there were one, two, three, four, five, six. These six things only cost me $53 and some cents in there. That is a come up, my friends. From Pretty Little Thing, I only bought one thing because I had already done most of the shopping in the other two places. So I was really looking for a red leather dress because one of the theme nights was like leather. So I, you know, I just wanted a red leather dress. And then I found this one and Pretty Little Thing, it was like 40 something. And when I put like the coupons, it has a few percentage off or whatever. It ended up being like 30 something, I don't know. So this is the dress. It's a size medium. I think I could have. It's a little big. I think a small. But the thing is that I know if I would have gotten a small, it's gonna be a little bit too short or too tight. And since it's like leather, it could be uncomfortable if it's too tight. Like you really can't move. So I feel like a little like I can move in this one. And the length is perfect. And the back looks really nice. I was actually surprised. I thought it was gonna fit a little bit uglier. I didn't think it would fit that good. It was a little bit chunky. And I know I was having th second thoughts about it, but I was like, mm, I'm just going to take my chances. I really wanted a red leather dress specifically. So, yeah, I took my chances. And I actually really like how it looks. It's super edgy and, like, I'm really digging it. I think I'm going to wear it with some, like, big edgy, like, white slash clear heels. And I think it'll look good. Do you guys see it? I wish this was a little bit tighter here, but whatever. That's fine. It's really cute. I'm digging it. Alright, Fashion Nova time. So I got this dress. It's a size medium. Did not get a small. I thought it was going to be too short, a little too tight. You know, I want to be free to move. Made the right choice. But it was extremely, it goes, it's open all the way over here. It was extremely too much and like, my boobie was coming out, so my grandma fixed it, got it tailored up to here. She closed it up, and now it's perfect. It's, you know, don't want to give up too much cleavage. It's just the right amount. And I think it's super cute. The fabric is super soft. It's like nice cotton. And it just fits really nice. Fits really nice. Let me see if you can turn it this way so you guys can see it. Oh, the setup is killing me in this room. So for Fashion Nova, I actually don't remember what many of the prices of some of the items. Um, but they were all like ranging from like 30, 40 something. But I had like 40% off, so everything came out to be a little bit cheaper. So that's good. And then this set, I bought it have, thinking like I was gonna have like an airport, like a like a use for an airport travel type of fit. And I really like it. I wish it was a little bit like higher, um, like more high-waisted. I think this is a size medium, I believe. I don't remember. Um, this is actually like the first thing I own that has like the knee length, like up to here. I always thought like it would look a little weird with my chicken legs, but it doesn't look that bad. I did think of wearing it with like a little bit of high socks and like very chunky like um, sneakers that I have. So that's the fit that I have in mind. Um, the fabric is like. I like the fabric is thick so it's not very clear it does not like feel cheap at all it's um it has a name but i forgot what it is hmm i forgot the name of this fabric i'll find it out and i'll just like 
put it down below or something. Anyways, fits really good. I really like it. I don't think I'll end up wearing it as the travel fit because it's a little bit like too much showing and like, you know, it's a lot going on. So, you know, I want something more casual, a little bit more covered up to be in the airport and stuff. But it's a potential fit for something else. So I really been wanting some cargo pants. I thought they looked super cute with like chunky sneakers. And I really had, I had like this fit in mind for the excursion that we're going to the Antelope Canyon and the horseshoe bend of like a safari type of like fit. So I looked for the cargo pants. I found them Fashion Nova. These are a size small. So they tend to fit a little bit big. I was like, mm, let me not get a medium. Maybe they're gonna be like a little bit too baggy and it's like uncomfortable and it's just, I feel like it'll probably be like too much on me. So I went with a size small and it fits perfect, nicely fitted in the back, but still, you know, there's space on the legs and I like how it feels. It has this very long thing, very long belt, but it feels, it looks nice. I like it. I'm probably gonna wear with like maybe this top or like another white top with my very chunky shoes and it's the perfect fit the perfect fit for what I have in mind wish I can show you guys the whole thing yeah definitely you see it's very like fitted fits really good I like it and okay so this bikini was somewhat of a fail it did not come true to size at all. This is a medium and I feel like the top, it's just a little bit small, but the bottom fit me like an extra small. It was literally a G-string. Look at this, it was, it was a G-string. It was like, there's no way I'm gonna wear this. So this came with like this belt right here. So then, turns out I had like this high-waisted bottom that is like obviously more covered in the back. And then I just told my grandma to take off the belt from this one and put it on these black ones and it looks perfect. There was just no way I was gonna fit my booty in here. Like there's just, I can't do it, I can't do it. It was just way too much in there. But look how good it looks. So if you were thinking of buying this bathing suit, just be aware that that bottom runs very, very small. And, and I think this is actually my last item from Fashion Nova, is it Jennifer? It is my last item. I wasted here a hundred dollars. Yeah, I wasted a hundred dollars, no more than a hundred because I remember it was like 150 with um Shein. So a hundred bucks shopping haul on Fashion Nova. Well that is all for my shopping haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am gonna link all the items down below. Hopefully they're still available so you guys can check them out. If you would like to see more of these type of videos or like style videos and put outfits together, mix and match here and that, um, just let me know down below. Or let me know on Instagram. Shoot me a DM. Uh, call me, beat me. If you want to reach me, you will. I will reply to you. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe to get that notification and I will see you guys when I am back from Vegas.